Welcome or welcome back at any help at C squared. In this example, we need to find this limit, limit when x approach to 4 of 2 minus square root of x over x minus 4. The first thing you want to do when you have to find the limit is to plug this value in and see what's going on. In this case, you have 2 minus square root of 4 over 4 minus 4. We notice 4 minus 4 is 0, but also the numerator 2 minus square root of 4, that will be 0. And this is what we call an undefined form. So we have to find some algebraic technique to get this limit. So the way I do it is limit when x approach to 4 over 2 minus square root of x over x minus 4. So you want to get rid of that 2 minus square root of x. That is uh, one way to do it. And how are we going to do that? We're going to multiply by 2 plus square root of x over 2 plus square root of x. And you notice this expression here is nothing else than the number 1. That's the reason we can multiply by and we can keep the equal sign. So let's see what we get. The denominator we just copy. And we have limit when x approach to 4 of x minus 4 times the quantity 2 plus square root of x. And what about the numerator? If you notice, we have two expressions that are very similar. They are just different by one thing, the sign. It's a minus b, 2 minus square root of x times a plus b, 2 plus square root of x. And this one is nothing else than a square minus b square. So in our case, a is 2, 2 square will be 4, and b is square root of x, square root of x squared is x. So we have here 4 minus x. And now you can do something here, but just be careful, be careful. You can simplify these two be careful, they are not the same, they are opposite, so you have a negative one here, very important. So you have negative 1 over 2 plus square root of x, and now we can plug in 4, and we have negative 1 over 2 plus square root of 4, and that will be negative square root of 4, it's 2, plus 2, it's 4, so negative 1 over 4. This limit, limit when x approach 4 of 2 minus square root of x over x minus 4 is negative 1 over 4. You can notice that also in the graph you see here, once you get close to 4, right from the left or the right side, the function is getting closer to a value here, which is negative 1 over for. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.